how to flash Android 15 One UI 7 firmware on Galaxy A15, a full safe guide. Okay, first to begin, you need to download the firmware file. You can download the firmware file from a website like uh, Sam Mobile. I will include uh, the description. Uh, so check the video description for details on how you can download the files. You also need to download the software called Alden uh, Tree. So download the Alden software uh, onto your computer. Once you have downloaded the firmware files, extract the files into a folder. Here, in here, it should have around five files. As you can see, there are five files within this uh, firmware flash. So make sure you extract it into a separate folder on your computer. Also, make sure you download the old software already and extract it into a folder as well. Then, now we're going to open up Alden. So run it. Then click on OK. OK, now I'm going to reboot the Galaxy A15 into download mode. So press and hold on the side button to power it off. Turn on power off, turn on power off. Next, we're going to need to use the USB cable. So connect the USB cable to the computer. And then on the phone here, we're going to now press and hold on the volume up plus the volume down key. Press on both keys and hold. And we will do this to boot into downloading mode. Okay, so let's do it now. Press and hold on both keys. And then plug in the USB cable and wait. Okay, now press on the volume up key to continue. Okay, we are now in downloading mode. And in the olden software, make sure you get the blue sign here. And here you can see it said added, the device added. Now on each on one each one of these items, you need to add in the relevant file. So we're going to add the firmware files to their designated slots, AP in AP, BL in BL, uh, CP in CP, and home CSC in um, CSC. So let's uh, add it in now. Okay, here we can try to drag it in, BL, we drag it to BL. And then AP file, we drag it to AP. Just make sure it's dragging. Okay, if this doesn't work, when you need to click on the button here to select it. Now again, it might need to take some time to give it a moment for the files to be added to the software. On the left here, you can see it says, please wait. So we just have to wait. Okay, that's finished. Next, we add in the CP file with drag and drop. And then CSC home into CSC text field right here. And we leave this one uh, as the default, empty. Okay, and leave everything else as the default. Do not make any changes in here. Just simply click on the start button. Here you can see there is a progress bar at the bottom. So it is now progressing with the update. And in Odin, you can also see a progress bar right here. So just let it be and let the update uh, finish. Just uh, be patient and wait. Okay, once it has finished, you should see it said all threads completed and then succeed equal one. And it should show a pass here at the top corner. Okay, so here it shows welcome one UI 7. Turn on the start button. And that's it. We have now successfully flushed the software and we have update our Galaxy A15 to Android 15 One UI 7. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. If you find it helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos.